now Central Oregon's local alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Bob Shaw. 22 minutes before the hour now on this Thursday morning. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. And it looks like if you have to get out and uh, drive somewhere uh, this morning, much, much easier than yesterday. We were ice covered yesterday, and that's not the case today. Nice dry streets across Central Oregon. Now, having said that, uh, just be aware that uh, going across the mountains, you still have to carry chains or traction tires and do watch for spots of ice through the cascades. 32 degrees right now at the Bend Airport. That gentle breeze out of the southeast has been pretty consistent all morning and you can see how clear the skies are. We've pushed a few clouds off to the east and uh, left us under some really nice conditions. 31 degrees at the Redmond Airport and uh, they have a very light and variable breeze this morning. Well, the deep south uh, looking at some storm activity. Uh, travelers uh, going into the uh, eastern Texas, uh, Arklatex region up into Missouri, uh, they're going to see a little bit of a challenge. High pressure gaining strength actually here over the west coast. Consequently, we're pushing clouds out of the area. And while we're anticipating the arrival of the next system, it's going to take a couple of days to get here. Uh, so we're looking at a beautiful Thanksgiving. Uh, clear skies are going to stay with us all day today and for the most part it'll be into tonight as well. Uh, we are going to see about lunchtime tomorrow we'll start to see a few clouds build in and it's part of the advance of this cold front. Now it will bring some late day showers maybe even some snow early in the evening and then <clears throat> excuse me it will pass through fairly quickly and we wind up with a Saturday that we'll see plenty of sunshine. Maybe a little bit cooler, but still not bad at all. Well, uh, locally, low 20s to low 30s to get the morning going. Not a great deal of wind right now, and for the most part, light and variable breezes will stay with us all day. For a period this afternoon, you may get a few gusty breezes out of the southeast, but they will turn light as we go into tonight. For the day ahead, look for highs. It'll be in the uh, low 50s for most. Upper elevations may struggle a little bit to get to 50 degrees. And uh, to overnight tonight, kind of scattered through the 20s once again, a lot like where we are this morning. Uh, we will see some storm activity start to settle in. Uh, actually, Saturday night, you'll start to see the clouds thicken just a little bit. Late day showers uh, on Sunday will be associated with that front that's coming through and it'll give us a chance of showers uh, right through the middle of next week. Much, much colder Monday and Tuesday.